Hey guys, what's going on? It's Del, and I'm back. And I'm back with a new series that I'm going to be doing. I know I've, there has been a s strong lack of videos as of late, but um, you may recognise this game. I'm not sure. This is Football Manager 2013, and so yeah, I'm just going to jump straight into this. Um, I'm going to be starting off with York, as you can see here, York City, because this is my home... This, this is where I live, basically. I live in York. And they've got an okay team. They've just been promoted up to League 2. So I thought I would see how I could do with them in this. And I thought I'd just make a series out of it, basically. So, yeah. Um, I've Literally, all I've done is started up the game. So we'll start off with um, the personal message from the chairman. So, okay. We'll attend the meeting. Hi Ford, welcome to the minced men, bloody 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 blah, yeah, let's pick that one. Um, uh, no, I already know about that. Uh, consolidate the club's existing position. No, I, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, I reckon we can come, yeah. I reckon we can finish top table, because, well, I'm not, I'm not the best person not fate manager but I reckon I'm good enough to take him to top table. Um yeah, a press conference. Do we want to do a press conference? Yes, I think it would be a good idea for me to meet yeah fine, let's do a press conference. Thanks for answering my questions. Okay. Hi Ford, I'm Darren Gee, your assistant manager. Firstly before we talk about team policies, do you want to arrange an inter squad friendly Yeah. Uh, schedule for tomorrow, report, yes please, would you like me to arrange a meeting, yes please, uh, fortnightly basis, that's what I usually go with, um, and I'll contact you if you need any help, exit, exit, okay, so first thing we're going to do, season expectations, top half finish I reckon, <laughs> gives me an extra 4k, is it worth it? Is it worth it? Yeah, okay. Let's go 30k. Uh, report on York, meet your staff. Let's just do this. Backroom advice meeting. Uh, get loan player recommendations for. Hmm. My FPS has just dropped. I'm not sure why. That's not a good thing. Um, get loan player recommendations. Which position? trying to think of the York squad. Let's get recommendations for striker. Uh, recommend defend left. Scout these guys. Scout these guys. McLaughlin taking free kicks. Yeah. Dismiss that. Scott Kerr taking corners. That works. Penalty taker. Jason Walker. Dismiss advice. On your banjo. And set 4 for 2. That's just a standard standard um, formation. I don't know why my FPS has just dropped so bad. That's um, interesting. Let's continue and see what happens. Why are you doing this to me, computer? Um, scalp the players. Right, the next thing I need to do is go, not transfer centre, go York, staff responsibilities. I want to do first team the assistant manager arranges friendly matches, runs the match training, and manages in the friendly matches. Those says pretty much instructions. Yeah. The, no. Let they them do that as well. Give team talks, attend press conferences. Yeah. Confirm. We'll do that. Continue. Mourinho is after Nani. That's really interesting. Apparently, we should go for these. That guy is out of our reach, definitely. That guy is probably out of our reach. Where's he at? Liverpool. Uh, loan move to here? I am not sure. We'll have a look in a minute. James to meet the media. Let's attend that. How involved do you intend to be? Uh, like to be involved as much as time allows you to be. These press conferences really don't make that much of a difference, they're just quite interesting to do. For some of them I'll send my assistant though instead. 
While some managers are famous for the hands-on approach, others maintain a more reserved manner with the players. Uh, they can come to me with anything. Uh, this is a wonderful feeling. Yeah, League 2 is my main focus. Tactical approach, football is about entertainment, yes. Um, yeah, thorough scouting. I'm happy with my squad. That's not true, but say it anyway. Do you already have a... No, we need to see them play first. I will be dipping my toes into the water. Leave press conference. And continue. Um, okay, so... Oh, first... Oh, uh, yeah, York Reserves. Okay, let's see how my current team, without me changing anything, does against the Reserves. Um, oops. Laggy, laggy, lag. Where? Oh, I'm blind. 5-1! Okay. That's quite good. Who's that? A cloak. Never heard of him. Um, guy is out for two weeks. That's fine. I don't know who he is, so I think he's in the reserves. That's very nice. 5-1. Oops. Wrong button. Uh, left back. Right back. Apparently I should get full. Right. Look at my squad now. Go to my tactics. 4 for 2 right. In goal, we definitely want Michael Ingham. He's our best keeper. Uh, Organising by best position. Muscle White, sub number 1. Okay, now, right back. Oye Banjo would be our best right back. Yeah, even though he's injured, we'll just stick it here, ignoring all injuries. Um, Fofield, best left back. Let's do that. Then McGurk and Jack O'Connell. I'm not sure who he is, but apparently he's good. Yeah, stick him at... Well, one FPS, that's really strong. Um, McGurk is the other thing about... Who's Jack O'Connell? Doesn't have biography, so it won't tell me where he's on loan from Blackburn. Okay. He seems good. He's only 18, but he seems really good. His current ability is forced out. Um, okay, do that. Then, right, so for the centre mids, we've got no one that's apparently good on the right mid or left mid. Centre mids, we're going to want Scott Care, MCR, McLaughlin, MCL. Now, look at the selection info and see who can actually play at right mid. Coulson, Rodman, Matty Blair. Or Chambers. Okay, that's okay. Any of those four. Alright. Look, now let's look at the stars. Mighty Blair can play left mid, call some right mid. Yeah, let's do that. Call some right mid. Mighty Blair left mid. Then we can have David McDade and Jason Walker. No, and Ashley Chambers up front. Okay. I would have thought Jason. Okay, Jason Walker's not as good as I thought he was then. Let's do that. Now we've already got sub number one. Now let's organise it by picked. Sub number one, then we can have. Sub number... No. No. Organise my best position again. Tom Allen? No. Chris Doig, sub two. Um, Chris Smith, Tom Allen. Let's stick Danny Parslow, sub three. Because you can only have... No, wait. Do you have five or seven? Seven, I think. Okay, yeah. So, Tom Allen, sub four. Michael Potts, Tom Platt, Alex Rodman, sub five, sub six, sub seven? Yeah, let's do that. Sub five, sub six, then Jason Walker, sub seven. Let's go through the rest and go sub eight, sub nine, sub ten. Sub 11 and sub 12. Very nice. That's sorted. Now I want to just really quickly go to my preferences. Go to match. Good, that's on low because I'm recording. A few matches in 3D. I could, I might turn that off, honestly, if it's really laggy. If it's really, yeah, if it's really laggy, we'll try it in the first game. If it's really laggy, we'll change some of them. Maybe turn that off. 
Um, yeah, that's all okay. If I to browse the game one match to be processed. That's fine. Let's just quickly check all these. Interface, my skin, I've just got the normal skin. Uh, GPS, I don't know what that, I don't I honestly do not know what that means. Competition screen, okay. Use players' shirt names on tactics pitch. That really doesn't matter. Okay, now let's continue and see. Oh, good grief. Scout all them. Hit continue. Let's look at the Capital Cup first round draw. I'm going to do an automatic draw. If it takes ages, then I will stop it and do all the teams. Shrewsbury Town versus Leeds United. Crew Alexandra versus Barnsley. Berry Town versus Leicester City. Port Vale versus Sheffield Wednesday. I may get some of these teams' names wrong because just like the town or the United or the city or whatever at the end of them because I don't know all of them. Hartlepool Town, Fleetwood United, Oldham, Athletic, Notts Forest, Ugh, Sheffield United against Burton. There's no huge games in here yet. The only interesting game really is Port Vale Chef Wednesday because Port Vale could cause an upset and Derby Accrington now. What's County Rotherham, Chesterfield, Blackpool, Scunthorpe. Right, if it's not done by there, then I'm just going to stop it and do all the teams. Rochdale, Middlesbrough, Walsall. How do you feel I've been to the Middlesbrough ground before? And the Leeds ground. Oh, York, Tranmere. Um, York Tranmere, that's interesting. <coughs> yeah, we'll, we'll see how we do. Uh, draw all the teams. Who, let me just see if Cardiff have got Barnet. Cardiff Barnet. Okay. Let's uh, let's carry on. Tranmere. It's at home. That can be a huge advantage for us. Our first friendly is against the Marine. What's next match? Yeah, let's just have a look at it. Default focus, teamwork, scheduling. Let's give him a little bit more. We don't have great training facilities. Marine, Stockport, Scunthorpe, Airbus. Who, who are this Marine that we're playing? They're not. They're not in a league. This is going to be fantastic. These guys would apparently be good, good signings. Let's just quickly take a gander at my reserves. Ollie Johnson, Jamie Reed. Yeah, they can stay in the reserves. And under 18. Funny thing about this, I know some of these people because obviously I live in York and I'm, well, I'm, I'm 17. I know Dan Andrew went to school with him. I was quite good friends with him in like year nine. Um, Mike, that Mike Atkinson was in the year above me. And then I know of Jordan Outbridge, James Green. I know of quite a few other people. But I just think it's quite interesting seeing their uh, how they progress, like just uh, how they progress through the game compared to just because I knew them. And most of them don't really go anywhere, if I'm going to be completely honest. Later in the game, because with my in my Man United game, I'm into 2018 and none of them have gone anywhere I don't think but yeah oh, come on the trialist teams oh good grief apparently he's really good as a new keeper let's look at him he's a striker and he's good and him JJ Hooper Okay, you know what, let's approach him. Once, apparently, he's in discussions with Dundee, not Dundee. Um, let's stick him on rotation, I still can't afford what he wants. Okay, will he accept 575? No, 725. He, he would probably honestly be in the first take. Let's go. let's just go 700. We've got... Even twenty-five pounds a week—that that matters when you're playing as a team this low. Um, he 
wants 725 and he wants his gold bonus increased. If he. Let's try 700. I can't click on 700 on that. Let's try that again. Okay, I'll accept that. See if we can get that guy. And then this guy, just look at him. Alex Pursehouse. Approach to sign him. He wants to be a key player. How old is he? 20. He does look quite good, if I'm being honest. A thousand pounds a week. Let's see if he'll accept 800. 975. Try 900. 975. 925. Yeah, there we go. Exit talks. Okay. Apparent. Oh, who cares about that? Really does not matter. Chelsea. Fellaini tempted by Chelsea. Let's play Marine. Let's see how we cope against these. Are there any big, big games going on here? I don't think so. Arsenal. Oh, Arsenal Leon. Villa Rangers. Could be interesting. Go on. Let's see who wins. Man City signed Ben Arthur. That's a decent signing. And Nanny's tempted by Real Madrid as well. Yeah, I sold Nanny to Chelsea in my game. I sold Kagawa to Real Madrid, Rooney to Barcelona. Quite a few interesting uh, things. Dundee and Colchester United are after Purse House as well. Clinical finishing. Yeah, there we go. 1 2 0. Jason Walker and that David McDade, who I've never heard of. N Power League 2 watch. Okay. Cross my pitch size. That matters not. Continue. And we'll see what happens. I think we'll get I think we'll get to Stockport, play the Stockport game, then call it a day for the first episode and I'll upload it and see how it goes before carrying on with any more. J oh we've got JJ Hooper. Okay. Good. That is very good indeed. Cause he looks amazing. With a five star potential. It was Ferris and why have QPR signed him? Palace on Andre Wisdom. What league? I think Stockport are in the league below. Oh wow, it's already gone straight to the Stockport game. Okay, I didn't think that would go that quickly. Maybe we'll carry on a bit further. Aberdeen against Boca. None of these are particularly fascinating. Winterton. I'm going to go check who wins out of Winterton and how. Hopefully Winterton, because that would be an upset. Even though it's still only a friendly. We'll see what happens. PSG have signed Anderson from United. Hmm. York in control. That's very nice indeed. 2 1. Oh, JJ Hooper scored on his debut. Even though it's a friendly, he scored. Uh, Ashley Joel, oh, no, he's going to be out for about a month. Darn gee, or G. Alan, team talk. Season ticket sales update. Oh, yay. 1,002. 1,003. Sorry. 1,150 add 100 is 1,250. It's not going to get to 1,300 if that is correct. Hmm. The board seems to not be too strong at maths. That's a. Uh, a rookie mistake there, schoolboy error. But um, that's it's gone up. <sighs> Man United reserves against Gateshead. Cardiff, Cardiff Benfica. It's on telly. Wow. Let's see. I forgot to check who won out of Win Winterton and thingy. Oh, well. I'm actually really curious about that. Hold on. What's my who's my email? Millerfoss York injury update. Uh, no, wrong one. Went to click on that. Go Winterton. Who won? Oh, they lost 3-1. Okay. Let's continue. I want to see who's won out of uh, Cardiff and Benfica, though. Oh, no, I lost 3-2. Well, that's okay. Honestly, we got two goals against a team that are in the league above. At, where is it? Home? It's, it's not too shabby. Not too shabby. Nil-nil. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's really not too shabby, honestly. Oh, Purse House signed for Colchester. That's not good. Hmm. 
yeah, I think I need to, um, where was, let's go back down and look for the scouting, see if any of these were fullbacks, striker, him, but he's not very good, Purcells, JJ Hooper, him, Yates, Port, he's a Port Vale, oh, see, I'd have, they're not on a free transfer, I much prefer to try and get guys on a free transfer. Let's play a search. A condition. Position, that's what we're after. Can play. Let's go all defenders. And his value? Would it be value? Is at most nothing. Let's see, yeah, guys without clubs. But. No. Huh. That's not what I'm after, I don't think. Um, I'm not sure what the actual attribute base goes to. Contract status is expired. There. Aaron Lescott. Defensive right. Stephen Oll. They're both centre backs. That's centre back. Aaron Lescott. Let's have a look at him. Newport County, Oxford County, Aldershot, Kidderminster. Okay, yeah, I want him. Let's try and get him, approach him. Wow. Yeah, you can definitely have that. I should probably offer a bit more to make sure he comes here instead of the other ones, but... We'll see what happens. I think I'm gonna order them by age, and wow. Okay, there is a lot of fullbacks in this game. Holy fucking moly. Let's... Okay, let's go up to about the 18 year olds. There. How many 17 year olds? Wow. Yeah, let's get these guys. Let's just pick out. No, let's order them by position. Fuck. Let's just get a random assortion. Assortion? That's not a word. A random. lot of those guys. That was. Okay, so that's 10 left backs. Let's just go get 10 right backs. Right back from there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, I've already got Aaron Lescott. No, let's not get them ones. Let's go from under Aaron Lescott. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Where's he from? Is that Algeria? No, Afghanistan. Oh, yeah, of course. AFJ. AFG, sorry. Not A. LG. Continue. Important date Airbus. Okay, let's get to the Airbus game. Look at some of these scout reports and. Then we'll call it a day. And holy fuck. Start individual training. Start all these trainings. Approach these guys. Richard sneaks. And even. Oh, fuck it. Go for this guy. He wants. 925. Can I offer 525? I'm sorry. That's not going to work. Approach him. He wants 275 pounds. Apparently, this club is close to his heart. That's cool. Let's get him. Scouting edition. Andrew Anderson, Ron Mc... Let's get this guy. £25 less a week. Yeah, I accept that. Good. Loan list. He should be listed for loan. He should be listed for loan. Dan Andrew should be listed for loan. Ollie Smith should be made available for loan. Change his squad status. John Shell or not. No, he's still needed. Yeah, he can be a backup. Chris Dickinson recommends offering. Oh yeah, he's three star. Yeah, we'll definitely offer Chris Dickinson a contract. Final deal, exit talks. Eligible for doesn't feel, doesn't feel, doesn't feel. Upgrade youth facilities. Let's see. Okay, no, f no funding. That makes sense. Okay, let's continue. See what happens with Airbus. See if we get a few of these scout reports in, and then we'll. See what happens there. York players in the last game. We'll sort that out later. Squad win bonuses. We're going to do it low because we're low on finances. Tottenham. Henri as a scout. Huh. Alex Rodman. Okay. These. Yeah, right. This was probably to be expected. Most of these are probably going to be utter shite. Uh, continue again. Semi-professional Welsh club. Huh. 
well, we'll see how we do against them. Alfred and Want Plant, yep, they can have him. Dixon does professional. They're both shite. McKinnon is set to sign for York. And Macmillan is set to sign, sign for York. His first scout report. Wow. Whoa. Okay, he's found a fair few decent people. That guy's not even at the club. He's fighting off interest from Doncaster, Portsmouth, and Rio Avon, Wickham. Okay. Stephen Old. These guys are both. He's 34. Let's see. Okay, let's just suggest that and see if he'll accept that. And Stephen Old. He's a centre back. Do I need another centre back? No, let's leave it at that. Although another keeper actually might be nice. John Stewart, Rob Langton, Aaron James. All the keepers are at clubs. With no unsigned keepers. Yeah, and I don't want to pay for any one right now. Try and save my money for the time being. Just try and pick up everyone on a free transfer and put as many mo as much money as possible into my wages. That's actually something I need to do, um, really quickly. <laughs> Boardroom is already all in my wages, good. How much transfer budget could I get? 138k. Mm, not enough. Okay, so what was this? Uh, pick the squad, respond. JJ Hooper's all under 21. To 21. Okay, good. Um, selection. I, yeah, I still have room to sign five more players as well in that squad. Uh, they're all half. He's two star. That's interesting. Platt's going to hide. That's fine. Kirkich has just gone to Arsenal. I'm not sure who Kirkich is. Squad numbers. Um, does anyone have preferred 17 and 24? They've got them. It's just JJ Hooper, um, number 18. Who's, wait, submit numbers, but who's JJ, does it say, no, York, JJ Hooper, who's he wanted by? MK Dons, not free, no. I've got him for three years. Huh, Airbus, York, continue. West Brom signed Joe Allen, is that? I think so. Mancini wants Kaka. It's an interesting signing. Benitez wants Sven Bender. York see right off see off brave Airbus. Uh, Walker, Chalinor, and Oh, Everson. Okay. That's fine. And we've got Aaron Lescott. Accept. Okay guys, we are gonna call that a day. Whoa. Okay, hold on. Wait. We're going to call that a day in a minute. He's interesting. No, thanks. Right, we're going to call that a day. I will save it right now. And I hope you guys really enjoyed. If you've got any suggestions or whatever, then just let me know. Um, if you'd like me to skip out some of this stuff and then summarise it, maybe just summarise what I've done at the end of maybe each week or every fortnight and then show the games when I'm playing the games, let me know. Um, I'm going to be posting this on our Football Manager games, because I reckon I could get... because obviously I don't have the highest amount of subscribers right now. And I'm just, so I'm just going to see where I can get publicity for this from. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please let me know and like the video and stuff like that. I'll vote it on Reddit if you see it on there, because that really helps me. It motivates me to carry on making more videos. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in the next video. Ta-ra for now.